Against all likelihood, there exists a universe consisting only of soil. Deep inside lies a vast spherical world. Its people call it Asposia. Air enters this world through the three holy wind fountains. To this day, the origin of the wind is widely disputed. But the fact that it is dying out little by little is undeniable. Without the wind, the light went out. Without the light, the warmth went away. And in the cold darkness, the wind gods came. They have been haunting the Asposians ever since with their petrifying stares. The only wind fountain still blowing is guarded by the abbot Conroy. He has devoted his life to leading the Asposians through these dark, cold times. Every day, Conroy preaches of austerity and obedience, in hope that the wind gods will one day be appeased and the wind will return. He is often observed by his young apprentice, Robert, whom Conroy has raised like a son. Well, not like his own son, of course. allowed to take that. It belongs to Conroy. I polish it every day for him. Pretty, isn't it? Oh, look what it can do. Conroy says it reminds him of the most beautiful day of his life. Of course, he's never told me what that means. But you know what I think? It has something to do with that. I bet you've seen a lot, hmm? Being a pigeon. You know, I've never been allowed to leave the palace <gasps> because of my strange holes. I wish I had stripes like everybody else. But look here. I knitted it myself so that no one will be afraid and of me. And if the Basilian oh, turned uh, to the uh, stone, uh, it's your uh, own fault. Oh, these ungrateful worms. I'm only trying to help them. <clears throat> oh. <sighs> Robert, my dear boy, play my song. <gasps> oh, Robert, how many times do I have to tell you? One note, one beat. Hmm? <laughs> No! <laughs> no! What idiot let that thing in here? Uh, don't worry. Pigeon, I trusted you. I'll save your pendant. No, Robert, boy, stay here. Guard, bring me the hedgehog. Oh, uh, hey. I'll catch it. Kitty, kitty, kitty. That thieving pigeon.
Slippery little... It's too fast. Well, uh, if it's just lying here, I guess I can take it. Oh, now the crutch's tip broke off. I hope the crutch's owner doesn't come back. Although I'd be faster anyways. Rather not. He looks like he's upset with me again. Oh, great! My own windsock. Windsocks are awesome. <laughs> Don't take down the posters. I wonder why they search the girl. She looks rather nice. Hello, can you help me? That depends on what you need. I don't have garbage. Garbage? Pardon? No, not me. Nobody's stealing garbage here. Especially not me. Well, I'm actually looking for... Do you need garbage? Can you help me? I have to catch that pigeon. Sorry, kid. If I leave my spot, everyone will steal my garbage. But who would... W I only see one potential suspect. What do you sell here? Well, I don't want to brag. But I have the best garbage in Esposia. You sell stinking garbage? Ah, I see. You're an expert. Since when are you into garbage? I've, um, always thrown it away so far. Well, then don't be shy. Go ahead and look around my little shop. What's that? This? An exquisite sandwich. It has only been eaten twice before. Um, thanks. I'd rather not. You sure? I also have a half full root milkshake to offer with it. At least I'm pretty sure that it's a milkshake. No thanks. I've somehow lost my appetite. Who knows if I'll ever find it again. What's that? It's the best bird feed. I swear, no creature with wings can resist it. Great! That's exactly what I need. Can I have it? For a few aspororo, it's yours. Aspo ra ro ri sounds great. What's that? That's the price for the.